Hello and welcome back all you Stouse fans. We have another friendly match for you here today where St. Andrews are taking on the might of South Africa. So let's get into it. And here we have our home ground of C1. Ladies and gentlemen, good evening to you all for this T10 between universities and South Africa. I'm Michael Slater, and this is Mel Jones. Couple of changes to the St. Andrews squad. We have James Threlfall, JT, and Angus Stewart coming in for their first games. Yasson gets a go up the order along with Paul Smith. Thanks, Mel. I've been looking forward to this. Roger Price, our winner of the best performance in a friendly match. At number three as well. Stan out there for the toss. And we have won the toss. I'm going to have a bowl. Bowling first. Good decision, I'd say. And here we have Angus Stewart to open the bowling. In his first match for the club. Oh, and this one's down leg. Not a great well. start from Angus. But it's a top ball. Angus in again. This one's swinging into the left-hander. Feel it up there by Haynes at mid-off. Angus in. Bowls. Yeah. A full toss and driven out through the covers. Seagal out there on the boundary. Does the fielding. South Africa. Get Thankfully, Stan was backing up. Angus and again. Hendricks this time. This one's Great cut game. away. Hendricks, sorry. It's gone for four. Good way to get off the mark for Hendricks. There we go. It's a better length from Stewart. Finds the edge. Final ball here. Full outside off stump, driven through the gap at cover. Scale out there, once more, does the fielding. Here we have Armstrong from the other end. See how he does, bowling into Hendricks. Full outside off stump and hit up and over cover. Scale's back there, does the fielding. That's a great piece of work there by Seagal, and I think that's going to be out. Yes, it is. Well, some very good fielding has created a chance out of no Not great way. running there by Reza Hendricks. And McLennan's credited with it in the scorebook, but we're going to give it to Seagal. Great work out on the boundary. One for seven now, South Africa. Baf Duplessis in. This one's full outside off stump. Played away through the offside. It's a dot ball. Armstrong in once more. Shorter and pulled oh, up, up nice. in the air. There is a man back, but Crooks can't get to it. Armstrong trying to reply now. Full ball, driven out to point. Smith does the fielding. Fifth ball the over. South Africa, one for 11. Yep. This one's full and finds the inside edge. It's got to run away towards the boundary in front of the pavilion. Maybe not. It's a great chase there. Don't know who that was at third man. They take three. Brings to cock on strike. Armstrong none for eight. One's full and laid away through the covers. Haynes does the fielding. Stewart continuing. Tidy first over from him. One's a little bit shorter and played away off his back foot. Short again, finds the edge, but doesn't carry through to McLennan. Stewart in, full, and gets the inside edge. A get through for a single, though. McLennan tidies up. One's a good here for St. Andrews. Stewart into De Kock now, finds the edge again. Fielded at backward point. Making hard work of it at the moment, South Africa. 
Oh, and another edge. This time just wide of short third man. Now get another through for a single. Edge. Final ball of his spell here. Very tidy from Stewart. Short and cut behind point. Smith's after it. They'll get two. Will they come back for a third? No, they won't. Well fielded. A good over comes to an end. It's a great spell from Stewart. To cock on two off six deliveries. And short and punched away. Armstrong in again. This one hit through covers. They'll get a single. Bryce Fields. Duplessis on strike. He's on 10. This one finds the edge. He's swinging hard at it. It's running away to backward point. Smith's after it. Flicks it back. Great work from Smith. And the batsmen get three. Three runs there. Armstrong in once more. This one's full and finds the edge through to McLennan, but into the ground. Two balls left in Armstrong's spell. Full and slow and hit up and over. Wide mid on. Split the gap between the man in the infield and the man out on the boundary. They needed that, South Africa. Last ball of his spell here. Armstrong in. This one nudged through wide mid wicket. And it's going to beat the man out there. Good finish for Decock. St. Andrews sticking with medium pace here. Price into the attack. This one's full and flicked away through the onside. That's a great shot from Duplessis. Batsman starting to find their feet here. Bryson again finds the edge. Bryson third ball of the over. This one's driven out to point. Smith fields. Bryson once more. Fourth ball of the over. Finds a little thin edge. Well tidied up there at third man. Two balls left. Good recovery here from Price. Late cut down to short third man. No run. South Africa just unable to find those ones and twos in between the big shots as this one's an inside edge. McLennan's after it. They'll get at least two. They'll come back for three. No, they won't. Great work from McLennan. Jesson to replace Armstrong. South Africa 1 for 36, the halfway stage. Right there. Top ball first up. To cock on 11. This one's full and finds the edge. The ball the over for Jess. This one yeah. finds a big edge. Splits the gap there between McLennan and short third man. They'll get one. Very tidy this from St. Andrews. Oh, this is short and wide. That? Go through to the keeper. And yet given as such by the umpire. Whoa. Where was that going? Jesson again. Yep. So I'm driven out through the covers. It's a girl on the boundary. They're coming back for two. There's a chance there. If the throw had been a little better. Good work though. Two balls left in the over for Jess. He's in. Bowls and beats Duplessis outside off stump. That's a great ball. Final delivery. This one's shorter and driven out to the covers. Good over. Nice bowling. Haynes into bowl now. First off, that off cutter flicked out through mid wicket. Crooks can't make it. Four runs. Tukok moves to 16. This one's outside off stump. Hit up and over point. Seagal can't reach that one either. South Africa move to 48. Haynes in. We'll need to come back from here. Flick through the leg side. We'll get a single. 
Hands to Duplessis. Both batsmen on 21. This one's shorter and punched out to the offside. Ends in again. Wider down leg side and helped up and over fine leg. That's gone all the way. Ends in. Final ball of the over. Sends full and strikes the batsman on the pad. Hit him outside the line, I think. Price in for his second over now. Time full and edge through backward point. Smith's after it. They'll get two. Will they come back for a third? They want it. They're coming back and... Yeah, no. Throw from the deep. On target. And a 50 partnership here. Off to a strong start. All batted these two. Price into Duplessis. This one's shorter and cut away behind point. It's hit that well. Good shot. South Africa starting to find some momentum. One for 62. Price in. Bowls. This is full and driven out to the covers. And they go through for one. Get one. To cock on 24. Price is in and this one's helped up and over the leg side. Crooks is back there, won't reach it. Two balls left in the over. Price in, driven out to cover. They'll get a single. One run there. Last ball of the over here for Price. He's gone for a few. He's full and driven out through the gap. Cover sweep is coming round. Seagal gets to it. Might be tight here. No, it's overthrows. McLennan just watches it go by, and St. Andrews really didn't need that at this stage. Ains into his second, first going for 15. And that first ball's helped up over wide mid on. Four more. South Africa got a head of steam up at the moment. Ains in, bowls. One's short and wide outside off stump. Seagal does the fielding. There's a huge mix up here. And there's another run out for South Africa. Great recognition from Seagal, knowing that he had to go to the keeper's end. Goes to McLennan once more. But Decock run out. New batsman in for South Africa, Klaassen. Aims into him and oh, what a delivery. Nearly takes out off stump. Hands in again. This one's helped up over the leg side. Hit that well. Crooks won't get to it. Four runs. Two balls left in the over. Hands into Klaassen. This one's full and looked out through mid on. It's going to be another boundary here for South Africa. They're doing it in boundaries at the moment. Final ball of the ninth over. Yep. Ball and driven. Dot ball. Well, he was smashed all over the park. The right armor is coming on to bowl from the university end. Here we have Jess to finish. Duplessis on 38. Yep. One's full and driven out to the covers. He'll get one. Jessen again. Comes outside off stump and played through leg. Somehow got that shot through wide mid on. All the way. Wonderful. Two for 92. Four balls left. Jess in. Bowls. This one's wide outside off stump. Finds the edge. Three balls left. Jess in. Driven out the covers. Scales the sweeper out there. They settle for one this time. Duplessis on 39. Two balls left. This one's driven and well fielded there by Jess. Final delivery of the innings. Jess in. Bowls. It's wide outside off stump. You'll have to re-bowl that. Two for 94. South Africa. Jess in. Bowls. This one's hit up and over the leg side. Crooks will get to this one. They're coming back for two. 
And McLennan misses the stumps and there's going to be an overthrow. Well, South Africa ends 2 for 97. San Andrews are going to have to bat well here. Rabada to start off. It's a girl on strike. Cut away. Calls them through for a single. Well run by Smith. And Andrews off the mark. First ball. Rabada into Smith. Just full and flick through the leg side. Good dive by Seagal and they get the one. Rabada into Seagal. Oh, well bowled. Better bounce outside off stump. Butter and again. Seagal inside edge and that's a wicket. No challenge here and Seagal goes caught behind for one. The wicket brings Price to the crease. Big task here for these two. Rabada in. Balls to Price. Just cutting at that one down to short third man. Get one. Last ball of the over. Only three off it. It's one dab down to short third man. Through for a single again. It's a fantastic over we for South Africa. And Giddy in now. For the second over. Falling to Smith. This one's short and Smith's pulling. Gets it into the gap. They'll get one. And get it to Price. Oh, beats him. Well bowled. Third ball the over. Oh, that ball may have gone into the stumps if they'd left it. Left it. Smith on three. Gideon just leans on it through square. They'll get one. 91 from 50 balls. Gideon to Price. That's not the shot I tried to play. Last ball of the over. Price struck by that one. Takes it with him as he runs between the wickets. Very good over there for South Africa. All the momentum with them at the moment. Price on one. Pulls this one straight at the square leg who kicks it towards the stumps. Leans up in the end. It's a dot ball. Butter in once more. Another league by for St. Andrews. Not a great batting display to this point. Right into Smith. He's hit this high over the offside. He has smashed that. Where did that come from? Much needed for St. Andrews. Smith moves to 10. Right in once more. This one's short and he pulls it. Down to the man at fine leg. Eighty-two from forty-four. Rice on strike. He's on one. Knocked off the back foot. Oh, direct hit there. May have had Smith in trouble. Final ball of the over. Smith pulling down behind square. He'll get one, and it'll stick with one. Gave a few too many away in that This over. bowler knows how to give the ball an almighty tweak. Let's see how they go. Spinning now for South Africa with Tahir. Full outside off stump and just driven into the covers. Easy single. single there. Price on strike. He's on two. Struck there. 
And yeah, he's given. Well bowled by Tahir. Bryce misses out. Which brings the other debutante, James Thrillful, to the crease. Tahir into him. Leans on it, but can't beat the man at mid-wicket. Tahir in once more. Pull outside off stump and driven through the gap. He'll get one. Coming back for two. Direct hit and Smith's in trouble. And yeah, another wicket for St. Andrews. Smith goes for 13. And warning bells sounding here for the Staus team as the Captain Franklin comes out to the crease. Ball and nudge through the leg side by Thrillful. Get one. One run there. 77 required for St. Andrews. Oh, great wrong in there. And Franklin's out. First ball. Franklin challenging that one. It's a great wrong in from Tahir. Very short though. Hitting in line. And, the and there we go, three reds, there. and Franklin has to go. Well, that's a duck for Franklin. All for 21, St. Andrews. Crooks in at the non striker's end. 77 from six overs. New bowler is in. Riffle tucks that behind the square and they get one. Crooks to face his first ball. Just runs this down behind square on the offside, but can't beat Class in there. And again, Crooks is hitting this hard over square leg. It's a great shot. Seventy-two from thirty-three. Oh, well bowled! Great movement. Oh, not able to connect there. Two left in the over. Crooks is driving this one. Hit that well through mid wicket. Sixty-eight from thirty-one. Crooks nudging that one in front of square again. Another single. To here to Crooks. Two for three. Crooks nudges this one through the leg side. Get a single. JT on strike now. E2 playing that through leg. And a single taken. One's aren't enough for St. Andrews at the moment. To here and to Crooks. He's hitting this one hard and high, straight. Is it going to beat the man? Yes, it will. Six runs. To here and once more. Crooks just tries to nudge that down leg, but can't beat leg slip. This one's wide and left alone by Crooks. Goes through the wicketkeeper. They're coming back for two. Good running there. And it'll be wides. That's just wide. To here and once more. Crooks hitting this one up over cover. Gets a lot of that one. Right out of the middle of the bat. Glorious six. Last ball of the over. Waiting. This one's hit straight. Can't beat the bowler though. Bit expensive in that one. 50 runs from 4 overs for St Andrews. It's a big task. 
to short and JT gets a little top edge. A lot of diving going on, but they're through for a single. Morrison to Crooks. This one strikes him on the thigh. They'll get through for one. JT on five. Hitting this one square. They're running with the shot. Good running there from Crooks. 47 from 21. Morrison. Bowls and that's a lot of movement there off a short length. Morrison once more. Crooks is hitting this high. He's not got enough on it. And Midoff has dropped it. They're back for two. Bit of fortune for St. Andrews. They need a lot more. Last ball in the over. This one's full and Crooks is hitting that up and over mid-wicket. Like making the fielder pay. 39 from 18. JT on strike and Gideon to bowl. Short and wide, plays and misses. Tries to drive that, but missed times. It's gone for four buys. Didn't even see that. And Gideon again. Again over the wicket keeper. Missed times that one. Well, two fortuitous misses there for St. Andrews. Brings the score to 67. 31 from 16 now. <gasps> JT struck by that one. It bounces out through mid-wicket. That's been coming back for two. Crooks dives. Swing and, a miss. and they're through. More 10 runs and extras. Of the first three deliveries in this over. 29 from 15. This is full and JT's playing this through the leg side. They'll get one. They're coming back for two. Big dive and JT's safe. Great running. That's the 50 partnership. A good job. And a 50 partnership between these two. Two balls left in the over. 27 runs required. From 14 deliveries. Short outside off stump. Plays and misses. Apparently that's the one for the over. Final ball here. Oh, plays and misses. Does three full. Morrison again. His second over. St. Andrews need 27 from the final two. Full and played away. They go through for the leg by and Thrillful's going to be short here. Unnecessary, didn't need that, and Ruffle can feel a little bit hard done by as McLennan wanders out to the crease. 27 from 11 needed. Can these two do it for St. Andrews? Morris is in. McLennan back, cutting. Get a single into the covers. Brooks on 30. Morris into him. It's hitting this one up and over mid-wicket. Got a lot of that. That's a good bounce. One bounce four, I think. Morris to continue. Ooh. Crook struck by that one. Thinks about a leg by. Sides against it. The batsman didn't know where that was going. 22 required from the last eight balls. Crooks on strike. Morrison to him. Pulls this one. It's going to go down to fine leg. Just for a single. Final ball of the over. Been a good one so far for Morris. He's into McLennan. McLennan hits us up and over. There's a man back. It clears the man by quite some distance. What a shot. 
The right arm pace bowler is coming into the attack from the university end. Plenty of wickets in hand heading into the final over. 15 to win. Brooks on strike. Gets us down towards final leg. There's a man back and he's taken. It's carried out to the man at fine leg and Crooks goes. And it's a dot ball for South Africa as well. 35. Well made in the end. And Armstrong out to join McLennan. 15 required from 5 balls. Don't know what happened there. Needs a direct hit. What on earth happened there? McLennan's run out. Very good fielding has created a chance out of nowhere. Great work. He wandered, charged down the wicket, then started running. Not quite sure what's going on. Two new batsmen in. 15 from 4. Doesn't quite carry to the man out on the boundary. They're coming back for two. Armstrong's off the mark. 13 from 3 required. Swing and a miss there from Armstrong. 13 from 2. Two sixes to get us through to a super over. Armstrong's hitting this one straight. Can't get it over the field. It's a drop catch. The writing is on the wall here for St. Andrews now. Haynes tries to go after it, but can't get any bat on it and St. Andrews lose this one by 11 runs. Well another good game here from C1. A 10-10 between St. Andrews University Staff Cricket Club and South Africa. South Africa put into bat, managed to get through to 97 despite some wobbles through the middle. Some great batting there from Duplessis and Decock as we Take a look at their scorecard. Two runouts, both credited to McLennan here, though they both involved the fielding of Jason Segal out on the cover boundary. And 97 was always going to be a tough ask. Look at the St. Andrews bowlers, and a few of them took just a little bit too much stick. Haynes, 14 and over. Bryce, two overs for 25, and no wickets for any of them. So 97, 98 to win was always going to be a bit of a task, and was made an even tougher task by a steady flow of wickets. 4 for 21 when Crooks came to the crease to join uh, Threlfall. But some good heading by Crooks and some good support play by Threlfall, helped by a few extras, meant that they were in a position, St. Andrews, to really have a go at this total. But some mindless running and Crooks' dismissal meant that they fell just a little bit short at the end there. Armstrong and Haynes on a hiding to nothing coming in late. South Africa bowlers. Ngidi two overs for four. Doesn't tell the whole story because his over had two balls go for four buys and two leg buys so there were ten off those three balls. But a great effort all up by the South African bowlers. They were very tidy and put the pressure on the St Andrews batsmen. We weren't able to get it done. Oh well, it would be boring if we won everything, and South Africa are a good side. So I hope you enjoyed the action here from C1. I've been Jim the Editor. Thank you very much for watching.